What's good you guys welcome back to another video the monterey car week series continues today we're here at the porsche event works reunion turbos hit different especially in silver i'm already losing my mind these cars look so good and look at the weather weather is perfect Telling you guys, I'm already losing my mind. Just got here. RWB rolling out. Look at how wide that is. All right, let's get started. We're gonna start off over here with the off-road Cayennes. There's a lot to see. There's a lot to see. So many different Seems like there's a commercial going on right now. They make you fly. Okay, a set of Michelin Sierra Works reunion. And I look at Melanie here. I think she's got some certificates for a set of Michelins. If you are registered in the corral and or uh, with the judges group, we have your name. And what we'll do is we'll draw the winner and you have until 1, 1 30. Uh, 1 30 or so to uh, claim your prize and if you do that will be staying for the award ceremony and we will make sure someone goes home with that let me just roll a work in progress all right this certificate entitled due to one set of michelin is michael Again, if you're here, Michael, please make sure you claim your list of things and other sponsors that are here today. And I want to make sure that they have a rest of the rest of the Bell and Engineering, Packard Insurance, Princess Cruise Line, Comp Tuning, Look at the Recaro seats and the interior. Pelican Arts, McCullisters, Auto Transport, Expel, Pokemon, Deluxe, and of course HRE, jumping up to the stage for an announcement later this afternoon. And of course, acceptors will be here to join uh, Rana to share with you without their This is a no drone event, please. So if you yeah, have that drone, no please take it down. Uh, keep in mind we're next to an airport and there are severe penalties for flying a drone here. So please take the drone down immediately. Smells like fresh freaking leather. This is nice. This way. Yeah. I come back to these ones later. It seems like all the crowd is over there on the other side. We've got a pair of GT3 RSs. How cool is that? One with the blue livery, another one has the red. It doesn't get any better than this. Yep. 
Milo always hits. And it's a turbo. There's so many other cool cars we got to go check out on the other side, but I want to skip over. It looks like this is a 356 section. Let's check out this section real quick. All the same types of cars. Speedster. This one has a sunroof on it. Check out this one. What a color. You gotta love the variety and colors you see. Some slant nose action. Red looks good on these. Moss green. Black speedster looking wild. Targa. GT4. Weird. He's got these little, yeah. little 997 GT3 RS. I think is so mid. Huge fan of the 3RS. This is just so period correct. Another 997 RS. This is the dot two. Agua blue. I guess this is one of only 36 that got imported in this color to the US. So that's a quick little fact about that. GT4 RS. More RS's. GT2 RS. Look at this 996. This is GT3 Touring. I don't think I've ever seen a Touring GT3 in this generation. This is sick. The wheels. We have jets flying over us, but Jade GT3, we've seen this in the area. Check that out. <coughs> this is literally heaven. Oslo blue. So that's what this color is called. Seen this on 17 Mall yesterday. One of the best colors out there. And the wheels. Finish on the wheels. You guys can't really see the interiors, but it matches nicely. Two RS. We have a red GT3. My childhood dream was to own a 911 Porsche. 
That's gonna be me one day. The blue on this GT3. <laughs> And always appreciate an old turbo in this generation. <laughs> Takes it to the track. The color combo on this turbo though. Perfect. Cruiser right here. 996 turbo. Ooh, new GT3 RS. White is definitely the best color to get it in. Look at that massive wing. Interesting wheel color. I like it. Interior flawless. You guys got to see all the little details on this thing. Even on the roof, has that little winglet right there. I head towards the the restroom. Because it's oh yeah. No. Another side profile view on the new GT3 RS. That thing is just unbelievable. <laughs> you can show the wrong info on this. There's no way this is a 2008. Who did that? Oh, I know what happened. I recognize the car. I think the owner brought this car instead of his other uh, GT3 RS. Yep. Follow this guy on the gram, so I got it. Another GT3 with an insane wheel setup, carbon lips. Little Porsches, GT4s. We got all the colorways right here. Turbo S. Come here. I visited. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. Yes. Uh -oh. yeah, no, GTS target over here. Some more drop tops. Working it. Nice play. Look at this turbo over here. Optioned out very nicely. Has a full carbon roof. Wheels look fantastic. It's a good, good looking car. All black clear tails. 8K red line spider over here. Orange turbo. Interesting. First time I'm seeing this color on the turbo. Look at the design of those wheels on this thing. Absolutely slammed. HRE wheels on the GT3 over here too. HRE simply always killing it. Doing it right. CGT. Okay, okay. Almost get past this. Look at the way the Targa goes in. So busy trying to figure out how we can step up our game and create special experiences. 
you know, Alex is working on the shore side experience uh, that's exclusive to Porsche Club members. And we also talked about uh, last year about how do you bring some of what we're experiencing today with judging and such. And I had made the recommendation to have the very first die cast Concours SC. They looked at me like I was crazy and I'm like, I'm telling you, Porsche people will bring their model cars and they will compete. And uh, as it showed in the video, we had all displayed in the Piazza. So if you can't tell, I'm super excited, not only about the relationship, but the fact that we're going again. You might want to share with folks who haven't been over by the tent, which is uh, just in, you know, all the details, but just a rough summary of where we're selling December 9th. Sport classic right here. This rowdy color. Can I really enjoy it? Well, here's your opportunity to Irish green. Look at the And what does, like a, let's start with the minimum, the inside room, what does that start with like, in terms of price per person? Yeah. Okay. Guys, for a seven night sailing, you, you would, uh, an inside stateroom would at least be about $1,200 per person. $1,200 per person covers to uh, the Princess Cruise Lines Lounge, learn all the details. The couple that was here this morning, I'm glad you guys got a very special Taycan over there. Tell them about that. That's right. So it's. This is the nine, second five, year nine. that we're doing this because it was so popular last year. Uh, we created another Taycan uh, co-branded vehicle between the Princess Cruise yeah. and This one was 195. Um, it's also introducing our partnership uh, with Expedition. This is sick. There you go. On the turbo. Ladies and gentlemen, Jeremy on. Got the tank going. Princess Cruise Line, thank you guys for your support. I look forward to seeing a lot of you December 9th. If not on that cruise, maybe another cruise as well. Absolutely. All right. Thank you. And the show continues over here. I know. Gotta see how many cars are out and about. We saw that whole section over there too. 912s and 914s. And everybody has to drive. Look at these. So, all the colorways. Wow. This is wild. Just doing a little walk through. Boxsters over here. Look at this GT4 RS combo. Another one over here I want to show you guys. That green. Alright y'all, we are in my section now. The 911s. That's one good fucking 997. the best section in my opinion it doesn't get any better than this let's show you guys each and every single one of these this one has some bbs's on it
Madbin GT wheels, big wang, roll bar. Done right. Shout out to the owner. Look at this turbo. And just Rolls Royce mobbing out. No big deal. Just turbo. Done right too. Let's keep rolling down the lineup. Wow, look at this wide body 997 over here. Brody Farm wheels. Just look at this view right here. I'm sorry you guys, I am just missing it. See how wide this thing is from the back. Holy crap. That is a wide load for sure. Let's keep it pushing. So many nice cars. HR wheels on this GT3. Another 992 GT3 over there. Some turbos over here. 996. And the new body. S's times three. We got the GT3s. French one. Call this the pumpkin. Got that freaking combo. T37s on that one. Need to get an up close view of this thing. Remind me of the new GT3 RS wheels. Never seen that type on a turbo before, or especially an older one. GT2 right there. Didn't miss that. That's crazy. This thing gets slammed. Never see a 996 GT2 out and about. The seats in there, you guys can't see a good reflection, but there it is. That color, though, the servo has carbon wheels on it. GTS. In fact, they got a lot going on on this batch right here. My buddy's got a. GTS looking good. makes it look that much better. Yeah, no, 
one day, one day. That is pretty much a wrap. Got this Carrera S on BBS's wild color on this touring. Last section, I'll show you guys these cars real quick. Look at the rear setup on this one. tuning in again. This is such an amazing location. You know, we have our flyovers, we have cars, we got planes, and we're just missing trains, right? Exactly. Um, but everything over here is going so well. If you don't have had a chance yet, please come see us. We're in a big GT2 yellow box RS. that has 75 on it. We're celebrating 75 years of Porsche this year. We have our teams out there um, diligently working. We have several, several Porsche. Great. Are there this year? It's because of you and your
that right there is going to conclude the work reunion of that. Works reunion. Sorry, y'all. There's way too much going on today, I'm telling y'all. But if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe if you are new. And comment down below your favorite course you've seen in this video. Again, I wasn't talking too much. I just kind of wanted to stroll around and admire everything. But, man, car week has been fantastic so far. Best one yet, almost. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how tomorrow goes. Saturday, the final day of car week for me, at least. But, well, man, if y'all enjoyed, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.